The holidays are a really busy time, and it might be hard to find that perfect gift for the special people in your life. Well, in this video sponsored by Best Buy, I'm here to give you a bunch of gift ideas for all kinds of people. Hey, it's Joshua Vergara. What's going on, everybody? Let's get through some holiday gift ideas, all courtesy of Best Buy. So over at Best Buy, both in-store and online, they have a ton of different items of all kinds that you can search through. If you haven't seen my previous video showing off the many different kinds of products that are available at Best Buy, make sure you do so in the links that are below uh, so you can get even more holiday gift ideas. But with that said, I'm actually going to be unwrapping some presents from Best Buy in this video. I'm also going to mix things up a little bit because wherever applicable, I'm gonna just pop in uh, another product or two that might be related to each present that I open. And finally, to check out all of the items that are featured in this video, make sure you check out the links in the description and in the pinned comment below. If somehow you find yourself getting your gifts at the last minute, Best Buy still have you covered because thousands of items in their catalog are available for next day delivery. So with all of that said, let's finally get started. I mean, I have to leave the bigger presents for last, right? Very nice. Here is a great, affordable, simple product that can help anyone smarten up their home. These are the TP-Link Smart Wi-Fi plugs, which allow you to remotely turn on and off anything that are plugged into it. These come in a two-pack, so you can get started pretty easily. All you need is the item that you wish to plug in, a Wi-Fi connection, and then your smartphone to control it. Like right now, I have my main light plugged into it, and if I hit this switch in the app, it turns off. Oh, okay. <laughs> hit the switch and it'll turn back on again. What's great about smart plugs like this is that they integrate really easily with smart home assistants like from Apple, Amazon, and Google. So if you connect them to one of those services, you can actually control them with voice commands and make them turn on alongside other smart home items at the same time. And finally, in the app, you can also set schedules. Like for me, I have a light for my plants in my office that I have set to turn on every day at sunrise and then turn off at sunset. My plants get their much needed light and I don't have to really think about it at all. Let's keep it rolling with another home item. This one kind of for the kitchen. So I have to bring back one of my favorite items that I have ever used, the Blendjet 2. Simply put, this is a powerful personal blender that comes in handy for smoothies and protein shakes and milk teas. And it does have some smart features. For safety, the blades won't actually turn on until the container is screwed on just right, like that. This charging port right here is a USB-C port and then the powerful motors go for 20 seconds at just the press of a button. This just fits right into my tech world so easily with this USB-C port especially. And at its price, this is an easy gift to give just about anyone who will use it for their own home recipes. I'm sure anybody can find a use for the Blendjet too. We got ourselves a bag this time. They're not all going to be wrapped per se. Oh, very nice. We keep the smart home train rolling with the Nest Learning thermostat from Google. I'm actually very familiar with this thermostat because I've had a previous version of this in my office for years now, and it's made it super easy for me to cool down or heat up my office during the appropriate seasons. But this one right here that comes in this white color, and this does come in a few different colors, I went ahead and put it in my family home, which has been using an old school thermostat for way too long now. The installation is really simple and you're guided the entire way by the Nest app, after which point you can connect the smartphone to check the temperature, control the connected system, set eco modes, and create schedules. Especially since I'm in Southern California, we have some guidelines during the summer months that we have to follow regarding air conditioning usage. So even if we're kind of baking a little bit during the day, the nest can be set to turn on and cool the house down precisely at the time that we need it to be. And of course, it's very convenient to just turn it on when I'm away, so everything is nice and toasty or nice and chill once I get to that location. That's something that I do all the time on my way to the office. I'm actually on a roll with the home stuff, so I'm actually going to just grab this one right now and open it up because I know what's in here. Yep, this is the Vornado medium-sized whole room air circulator. If you've never used a Vornado before, they're fantastic at cooling down a room, usually all by themselves. Now, this is the medium size, so it is best for like smaller rooms, but the whole idea of this is that the blades of the fan are constructed in such a way that they promote full room air circulation. You just have to point the Vornado at one of the upper corners of the room, and then the fan is powerful enough to make that air spread out to the rest of the space. I have used Vornados for a long time in place 
of conventional fans, and let me tell you, they're fantastic to use in the summer months. After all, you can really feel the heat, especially when the air is just stagnant. So even if I can't have my AC on at any point, using this to make the air move in the room already makes the room feel more comfortable. Oh, and when the AC is actually being used again, you can point the Vornado in the direction of the vents where the cold air is coming from, and it just makes the room cool down even faster because it's circulating that cold air. If anything, you can get one of these now, and then you'll be ready for when the weather gets really warm or just hot again. All right, what do we have here? We're clearly moving into the health and wellness category now, and uh, if you had a keen eye throughout this video, you know that I'm already wearing this particular smartwatch. This is the Garmin Venue Square SQ2, which is actually a pretty recent release. As the name suggests, this is the Venue 2 smartwatch, but in a square shape for those of you that are into this kind of look. Now, Garmin are known for their products supporting runners, but they're actually just great overall fitness trackers. I'm certainly not a runner myself. You get insights into all kinds of stats, like your sleep, your steps, and what Garmin calls the body battery right here, which is an overall rating of your immediate energy levels based on everything that it is tracking. If you do want to pump up the intensity, not only is this thing great for tracking running and biking activities, there are actually a bunch of different workouts in here, and there are built-in guided workouts that allow you to fall back on them whenever you find yourself uh, needing a little bit of extra guidance. These HIIT workouts that I just showed you, I have definitely used this for a quick workout in like a hotel room after an especially unhealthy meal. And finally, it's actually just a pretty great smartwatch in general. You get quick glances at notifications from the smartphone that it is connected to, and then you get media controls. And the best part is that the Garmin Venue Square 2 can last for up to 11 days before needing a charge. If you find yourself having nightly charger fatigue with your wearables, the Garmin smartwatches are definitely worth your consideration. Since we're in the health and wellness section, I'm throwing my weighing scale in here, the Wythings Body Plus. This is a smart scale that gives accurate readings of your stats beyond just your weight. Using advanced sensors that work through the skin of bare feet, uh, I can get straight weight numbers, but then I'm also given my body fat percentage and my BMI, among other things. And all of the information is stored in the Wythings Cloud that you can connect via a smartphone app, so that every time you get on the scale, it automatically syncs and gives you a snapshot of your health over time. And it is a great way of keeping your yourself on track toward your health goals. And if you are working out a lot, or let's say running, or even just walking, you're probably in the market for some great audio products. My go-to earbuds, as you can tell from the custom paint job on these, are the Sony Link Buds S. The Link Buds S are a pair of great sounding, nice fitting earbuds that provide all the bells and whistles that you might want. You get touch controls on the surfaces, you get a great sound profile that you would expect from Sony, and you also get active noise cancellation. So when you have both of the earbuds in, you could just hit this button over on the side for when you just need to focus, or you want to get immersed into your content. But the word link in link buds means linking worlds together, and to that end, the earbuds have one of the best ambient sound modes that I've ever used. It allows for a lot of the outside world to still pass through, so even if you have like a physical earbud in your ears, you can still comfortably converse and interact with anything around you, or just have general spatial awareness, making them easy to just leave in your ears uh, and not have to fiddle with them. And they are also pretty comfortable. It's that level of control that makes these an easy to use earbud on the daily, and that's the reason why I really recommend them. And finally, for this whole health and wellness category, I am bringing in the Theragun Mini. Whether or not you're working out super hard, tense muscles are a thing, and Theraguns help ease that tension and tightness, leading to better recovery and more relaxation. The Theragun Mini is the most portable of the company's various products, making it something that you can literally bring anywhere and just relieve tension and just unwind at the end of the day, even on the go. It's super simple too, you just hit this one button on the side, it turns on, and then you can hit it again to change the intensity level of the percussive movement. Just target the right area and you can feel the relief. The app can provide guided sessions as well so you can easily make a daily habit out of relaxing problem areas like shoulders for me. All right we're down to the second and final bag <laughs> and we have ourselves a nice photo printer. Now I know that we're all about the digital smartphone photography life but sometimes having something physical is just more satisfying it hits those nostalgia notes and honestly it's just plain fun. And that's where this comes in the Fujifilm Instax Link Wide is a portable speaker that connects to your smartphone and can print out a physical photo or a physical print at any time. We're actually going to go ahead and do this right now. Uh, just get the app connected to the printer then select your picture and I think I have one good one in mind already. There we go, we're actually gonna go sideways since this was a vertical picture originally. Uh, you can do a couple of edits if you want with like various filters and whatnot. You can even add text and everything, but ultimately you're just gonna go ahead and hit print. 
I know there's the impulse to shake the prints, but look at this, it's slowly fading in. You can actually get anyone's pictures and send them to the link wide, making this something you can bring to a gathering or to a party and help create physical memories for yourself and your friends. I really wanted to put an item in this list for my fellow photographers, and this one just felt right because it can work for just about any kind of shutterbug. We all enjoy our physical prints from time to time. All right, finally, I know you've been eyeing it. It's been in the background. It's time to unwrap the biggest present. Truth be told, uh, the actual item that's back here is what is wrapped and not the box, which is why it's so large. I just wanted to have some real fun with this last one, so this one goes out to all of the gamers. That's right, this is an actual arcade cabinet for Street Fighter 2. Best Buy have many of the Arcade 1-Up products in their catalog, and I've been a fan of Street Fighter for years, so this one just made sense. As you can see, it's a full-on arcade machine, complete with stick and button controls on the deck, and in this case, we would call it a fight stick. The stylings are as retro as the games it plays, and for a nostalgic gamer like me, this is one of the coolest decorative pieces in my office, and now, for the background of my videos. But it's not just Street Fighter 2 that this plays, there are actually 12 games built in. There are quite a few versions of Street Fighter 2 in here, including my favorite, The New Challengers, but those are alongside games like Final Fight and even the original Street Fighter 1. If you know a gamer and they have some room for a real retro throwback, the arcade one-up machines are really cool and available at Best Buy. To end this video though, I'm going to pop in with a couple of items for mobile gamers, which can actually be pretty much anyone. Sure, arcade cabinets like this one are really cool, but for a more practical application for your gaming love, you can actually just throw a controller onto your existing smartphone. And I have a couple here. We have the Razer Kishi version 2 mobile for Android phones and the Backbone one for iPhones. I made sure to include one for each platform so that you have some choice. They're both really simple. Just slide the phone onto the corresponding data port. In this case, on the Backbone one, it'll be that lightning port. And then on the Razer Kishi made for mobile, it'll be USB-C. So you just slide it in and get it plugged in. The controllers are then just recognized by the Android or iOS systems. After that, you just fire up any game that supports controllers and you just go have a blast. I mean, touchscreen controls are fine and all, but nothing beats having tactile controls that get your fingers away from the action and free up all of the screen for maximum enjoyment and viewing. These are also quite affordable items, uh, considering how much they open up the level of enjoyment that you can have gaming on your smartphone. And so there you have it, a holiday gift guide for the many different kinds of people who might be in your lives, or just a great list of items that you can get for yourself at Best Buy. Remember, to check out any and all of the items that I have featured in this video, I have links to them in the description and in a pinned comment below. And again, if you are strapped for time, Best Buy can still help you out because they have next day delivery on thousands of their items. And lastly, I hope you all have a wonderful holidays and an easier time after this video, shopping for the people who are special in your life. But from there, I'm gonna go ahead and call it on this one. Thank you so much again to Best Buy for sponsoring this video and thank you for hanging out with me again today. Please take care of yourselves and each other and enjoy your tea, everybody.